opening with the queen's pawn controls the center and usually leads to a more positional development of the pieces. The Indian game begins by controlling the important e4 square with the knight, rather than a pawn. c4 builds a strong center by controlling the important d5 square and creates a square for the knight to come to c3 without blocking the c-pawn. e6 opens up a line for the dark-squared bishop and prepares to castle quickly, while preparing to push a pawn to d5 and recapture with a pawn if captured. nf3 develops toward the center, putting pressure on the e5 square and adding another defender to the d4 pawn. d5 takes space in the center, attacks the c4 pawn and helps control the e4 square. This activates a knight by developing it off of its starting square. nbd7 develops the knight toward the center, defends the f6 knight and controls the c5 and e5 squares. bg5 develops the bishop and pins the knight. This immobilizes the opponent's knight by pinning it to the king. After all captures, this is an equal trade. Takes back. The bishop is ready to be developed to an active square. This develops a bishop off its starting square, getting it into the action. This activates a queen by developing it off of its starting square. Castling gets the king to a safer square, out of the center of the board, while also developing a rook. Castling kingside tends to be safer because the king is further from the center. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. Recaptures. It is the last book move. Right on target. It is best. One of the best moves. It is excellent. That was a free pawn. It is best. This threatens to kick a knight. It is best. A very strong play. It is excellent. Takes back. It is best. Recaptures. It is best. This develops a piece while also winning a tempo on a queen. It is best. This attacks a bishop, winning a tempo when it moves away. It is best. This wins time by threatening a queen and forcing it to move away. It is best. This moves the queen to safety. It is best. That pawn was free for the taking. This threatens to prevent castling. It is best. Castling develops a rook, while also moving the king to safety. Castling to the same side of the board as the opponent tends to lead to less sharp positions as compared with opposite side castling. This is the only good move. This prevents the opponent from being able to prevent castling. It is a great move. There were worse moves but also something much better. It is an inaccuracy. This is not the best. It is an inaccuracy. This is not the right idea. It is an inaccuracy. This wins time by threatening a rook and forcing it to move away. It is excellent. This misses a better way to move a rook to safety. It is an inaccuracy. This misses a better way to connect rooks. It is an inaccuracy. This threatens to push a passed pawn towards promotion. This allows the opponent to challenge the opposing rook for the open file. It is an inaccuracy. This ignores an opportunity to challenge the opposing rook for the open file. This allows the opponent to push a passed pawn towards promotion. It is an inaccuracy. This blocks the attack on a queen that could have been captured. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. This offers an equal trade of pieces. It is good. This is an equal trade. It is best. Takes back. It is best. This attacks a knight, winning a tempo when it moves away. It is best. This permits the opponent to push a passed pawn towards promotion. It is a mistake. The passed pawn moves towards its goal. It is best. This offers to exchange pieces of equal value. It is good. There was only one good move in that position. It is a mistake. Recaptures. It is best. Very precise. It is best. The game was close to equal, but now white has the advantage. It is an inaccuracy. This overlooks an opportunity to defend a rook that was under attack. It is an inaccuracy. This misses an opportunity to move a knight to safety. It is a mistake. 
This permits the opponent to win a tempo by threatening a bishop. It is a miss. This wins time by threatening a bishop and forcing it to move away. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. That's what I would have recommended. It is best. This is the strongest option. It is best. Balanced neither player ever had an advantage. That game was pretty competitive. Both players had an amazing opening. Both players navigated the middle game well.